Hey everyone, how's it going? And welcome back to another Let's Play with Author J.P. Edgar, where, you guessed it, I play some game... Wait, wait a minute, that's wrong. This is a game I have played before. Bamboozle! Ah, I hit my hand on the... <laughs> I play some games I have played before, and today we are continuing our... Yeah, yeah I know, right? Our journey, <laughs> Dead Rising... PS4, holy criminy, best intro ever. But without wasting any more time, let's get going. Let's get going. Let's get going. How are y'all doing today? How the heck are you all doing today, Chad? Good to see you all here. I'm glad to see the amount of support I get from you all. And it really is heartfelt. It makes me feel good about things. So, as I was... As I was uh, doing the edits of the previous episode, I was, oh my gosh. As I was doing the edits to the previous video, I couldn't help but wonder what the heck is going on with that shortcut. I vaguely remember that shortcut actually being a thing. I'm actually gonna go this way because you can see all those uh, blue PPs. Those are zombies in the, uh, in the um, elevator. I'm just going to go around. But I distinctly remember a shortcut. I know there's a shortcut. I know there's a shortcut. So I'm wondering if, uh, if it's bugged or if I did something wrong or if I got to answer this call. Old man opening it. Entrance plaza through Paradise Plaza. But yeah, it's like, I need to find out what's going on with that shortcut. It's, it's, it's kicking my butt. Ugh. Because having to go through the courtyard the entire time, like every single time, is just, it's too much. Because those, uh, those Hummers are just going to raffle stop all the things. It's just going to roll. I, Something's, something's going on. So I need to go back and figure out what's going on. Or maybe, maybe I need to go to the other bathroom and unlock it. Maybe that's the case. Okay, where's the bathroom? Here's a save point. So it's actually through here. So maybe, oh, uh, what? So maybe that's the case. I need to unlock it from this side. So let's try that. I think it's this way. That's stairs. Well, we went to the ladies' restroom last time, so let's try again. To Wonderland Plaza. There we go. We have it. We have it. And there's Greg. Okay, so we have to jump up on the sink to get through. We have to jump up on the sink to get through. Just open a door. Just open a door. Oh, now Greg's following us. Now Greg's following us. Okay. But we still got the shadow of North Plaza to worry about, but now we don't have a lot of time. Okay, so we got that. We got that figured out. Um, but we still got a problem. We got the Shadow of North Plaza. We have Greg following us. I don't even know where North Plaza is. It's up there. North Plaza. North Plaza has to go through the park. We're not going to be able to reach that with Greg. We're not going to be able to reach that with Greg. So I need to go through here until I find the camera shot because that's the uh, that's my marker where the stairs to the security area is. So let's just do this for now. Let's um, where are you at? You're probably this way actually. Yeah, I think I'm going to uh, completely botch the shadow north, the the shadow of the north plaza. I'm going to botch that. 
I just don't have the resources and the time to do that because I got Greg in tow. All right, so there's the, uh, what do you mean? All right, looks like we're gonna have to cut some fools down. I can't even with this outfit. <laughs> There we go. So let's see, he's gonna go over there without me so he's not following me. So if I have to walk around and take care of some zombies, I can do that safely. I still don't know the radius in which they will actually um, follow me in the, uh, the stairs. Uh, let's uh, draw them this way. Let's draw them this way. Come on, Greg. Oh, that dodge. I forgot how painful that dodge is. So, Greg, you want to go over there? Come on, go over there. There you go. There we go. There we go. That empty brain smile on the logo's face. <laughs> Everything about this costume is genius. You know what? Let's see if I can do this. Yes. Give. Yeah. There. Now he has a knife. And I have a knife. So he, if he has to uh, shank somebody, he has the opportunity to do so. And that's going to be wildly helpful when I have to go through here. All right, you're nearby? Okay, we're clicking it. We're clicking it. I'm going to drink some uh, wine here, get some health back. All right, there we go. All right, um, so, oh, it can't go that way. So Shadow of the North Plaza is going to be a botched up um, quest. So let's move on to the next one. Next one is, oh, wow, there's a lot of stuff pretty close to one another. Mm. I don't know. You want to do I want to grab this. I, I think I'm going to need it for the, uh, the next section. But we'll see. We'll see. I don't know. I'm slowly but surely remembering certain things about this game. Scoop chance lost? That was a scoop? Does that mean I completely screwed it over? I hope, hold on a minute, let's check out the case file. Okay, so I didn't, um, I didn't miss out on the case because that's the important thing is the case. That scared me for a moment. That really scared me for a moment. Karen Machete, home store. Oh, don't cut me off like that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm busy getting eaten. Eaten. Okay, so I, I kind of am in a safe-ish area. Carrying a machete in that home store. Cameras are, he's doing a good job staying out of sight. All right. So what I need to do is I need to get some uh, get some food. I don't quite know. Oh, I know, I know. I can uh, go to a secret passage, secret tunnel. Yes, 
I can go through the secret tunnel somewhere. Where the heck is the secret tunnel? That's right, it's through the mountains. The stairs of the mountains. <laughs> oh, that's what I get for not looking where I was going. Making stupid jokes instead of actually playing the game, right? And then it's basically going to be to the right of here. Now, there's also something else that I'm not quite remembering, and that's how to move quickly. Secret tunnel, yep. Through the ladies' bathroom. Secret, 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 secret tunnel. Yeah. Nerds. <laughs> um, but there's a way to move quickly, and I just don't remember how. I don't remember how. And that's kind of also causing some hiccups. I need to get foods. Where can I get foods? Because I don't have any food now. Let's see. No, that's a gumball machine weapon. These are always fun. <laughs> but where am I going to get food? I'm just going to go over here until I get to the food court. Because there has to be food in the food court, right? That's the theory. That is the theory. Yes, I saw food there, but there's some wine over here. And I can get drunk off of wine. And wine heals a lot of health. There we go. There we go. And that's it. Now let's continue. That guy has... A queen, but I don't have the inventory space for a queen right now. Right now, I just have to go through this cluster. Oh, I was trying to jump up on him. I might have to do this a little bit. All right, rescue the professor. I think it's coming up. I think it's coming up. You know, I think there's a little bit of food right here, and I took a hit, right? Oh, there's orange juice, but I don't have uh, the health for... D disregard that. Just, just watch me drink just a whole thing of orange juice. Vitamin C. C isn't cool. So I just drank up vitamin cool. And over here. Oh, it's going to be a pain to get out. It's going to be a pain to get out. All right, here we go. I think it's just about here, right? Yeah. <laughs> How dare you hit a guy with Daisy Dukes on? How dare you hit a guy with Daisy Dudes? Someone shoot from the floor above. Watch out, Mama. Three six detectors. Don't be daydreaming out here, me. <laughs> if we don't do something, the professor's gonna end up zombie child. I'm going for it. You just worry about 
about staying alive. Got it? All right. So, as you may recall, last episode, he basically stood in front of the gun, walked down a hallway with a sniper. So, we're going to have to follow him. I'm also going to go this way to potentially draw his fire for Brad to do his thing. I have a Kanife. I do not have a gun. Oh, Otis, you picked the perfect times. What do you want? There's somebody inside the home and garden shop at Alfresco Plaza. I'm sorry. I'm in the I'm in the middle of a boss fight. Do you mind? Ugh. Anytime, Brad. Anytime. All right, so this is a good spot for me to uh, get some food. Okay, Brad, you got it? I'm going to tell the next person who bothers me in public that, excuse me, I'm in the middle of a boss fight. Yeah, that's what military training did. If they told me to do that. Oh, he just clobbered me with the gun. I'm coming to get you. I'm coming to get you. Oh, I'm coming to get you. Oh. I am not coming to get you. <laughs> I am not coming to get you. Oh, that's a lot of lost progress. Man. Excuse me, I'm in the middle of a boss fight. I actually got a phone call slash text slash email all at the same time from the same person. I should have said that. Excuse me, I'm in the middle of a boss fight. Where was that place? Uh, all right, just upstairs I go. Yeah, because look at that. Brad's getting chunked because I'm not up there. Look at that. He is completely helpless without my knife. There it is. That means case is lost. We have to load. What a useless uh, DA agent. So, yeah. Look at that. The entire game is foobar now. All I can do is either I can either load or I can just play until the helicopter comes and level up. That's basically what that means. Uh, it's all because of that grenade that I definitely, definitely was not prepared for. All right, I'm going to go here. I am not going to go after that guy. Because that's kind of what screwed me over in the first place, I think. So I want to go here. I want to see what this scoop that I so, uh, the so called scoop that I missed. I want to see what I missed. But we know where the secret passage is. <clears throat> because we have time to rescue the professor. Uh, I was hoping I could just climb over and jump down. No, I have to go all the way around. Ooh. Okay, let's just wait a moment for Otis to finish talking. There we go. There we go. Now, 
where do we need to go? There's also this, this question mark over here. So let's just, no, stick to the plan, stick to the plan. Follow the arrow. Stick to the plan. Follow the arrow. Here we go. Going back to this. So, <clears throat> fun fact. This song is not, I don't think, a, um, a Capcom original. So when I was uploading the videos, I, I got a, a copyright claim, not a flag, not a strike, just a claim. This song is a copyrighted song. The video is ridiculous. The video for this song is ridiculous. So I want to have to kind of be careful at some of the songs. Uh, if there's uh, copyrighted songs, I want to have to probably turn down the uh, the music, or you're going to have like a long period of silence. But yeah, I just uh, thought you'd like to know that. This is a ridiculous, uh, the ridiculous music video. Yeah. yeah, this is a ridiculous video. All right, we are here. Wait a minute, this looks familiar. This is the guy that limps, huh? Yes, I think this is the guy that has the limp. I guess I'm eating some chips. I'm not going to tell you what the music video is about. If you're interested, you'll just have to look it up. I'm actually going to be using this queen, not now, but in a few, because of the mess that I'm going to be getting myself into here shortly. I want to eat a baguette. And a grapefruit. Come on, dude. Hurry up. You see what I mean? This guy's just taking his time. Taking his time. Now we have to go through here. I can't attack while uh, he's on my shoulder. So I can uh, juke and dodge, but I can't attack. So I'm going to be going back to the um, security room to drop him off because I'm not going to be fighting. Uh, what's his face with this guy on my shoulder? You know what I mean? That's just bad news.
Oh, I barely made it. I thought I was getting numbed for sure. Barely made it. Okay. All right, so now we're going to go back to the copywritten uh, plaza. I can't even answer the phone with him on my shoulder. I can't believe this. <laughs> oh, don't interrupt me. Over there. Well, talk faster. Get to the point, okay? I do not have time to be wasting with you, Otis. All right, here we go. We got we got that. We can finally pick up David and move on. So here we go. We're just going to go straight over, drop him off, save this time because I did not want uh, to do this again. Yeah, this uh, this song kind of reminds me of uh, Beastie Boys. see if we just can't plow on through that looks like a hole and boom there we go this man's just running around in booty shorts crop top and a lego head holding a camera and a bag of chips <laughs> yep we have a good defensive position hold on this guy has a bag of chips Let, let's hear him out <laughs> <clears throat> You know, if you didn't have the bag of chips, I'd probably disregard him. But the bag of chips makes him look legit. Because he's all that and the bag of chips. I know, dumb. Just, but just bear with it. Uh, this might be a little cramped getting through, but we should be able to get by. We also have a queen for the elevator. The elevator is known to give problems. There we go. See? And just like that, boom, we are clear to go. He won't cl uh, climb with me on the shoulder, but he can climb on his own. As if he was pretending he had an injury. Look at that. I can only slowly walk, but I can climb like a boss. Okay. Here we go. There we go. And save because that was kind of one of the problems I had last time was I uh, moved on after an escort and I decided to face a boss fight and decided to lose the escort. So I'm just going to save real quick. What is our timeline looking like? All right, Professor, here we come. Here we go. We're going to be fighting a guy with a gun with a knife. Napping in that outfit. Yeah, you get the full glory of him just. <laughs> but remember, if we find another outfit, we have to grab it. We have to grab it. I don't know if I'm going to risk losing a hat or uh, wearing a hat to losing the, uh, the Lego head, but I don't know. There is a way to revert back to what you wore previously, so if we lose the head, we'll just uh, use it again. I just grab a fresh knife. 
before we head over to wherever the heck the professor's at, right? <clears throat> All right, so we're, we don't have a lot of places, we don't have like a lot of uh, maps to traverse it. There we go. I thought we actually had to go through the food court, but I have full health and I have um, a couple of things of food. So I'm not in terrible shape. What would be nice is if I had a reliable partner. Brad is definitely unreliable. Definitely unreliable. So it's like, what he's gonna do is he's going to run straight down, oh, that dodge. That dodge just got me hit. I hate that dodge. He's gonna run straight at him, down a hall, and not, like, not do any defensive maneuvers against a sniper. Brad is useless. Jeez. Okay, I gotta stop and eat. I gotta stop and eat. Drink some of my coffee creamer. And I'm down the ground again. And now I have to go all the way around. And by the time I get up there, Brad's probably gonna be dead because he doesn't know how to fight. It, he is like... He is the worst escort mission of the game so far. Look at that, I can't even get to him. I have chips. I wanna to have to eat my chips. Mm. All right, I have one health left. And I have nothing to uh, regenerate my health with. Oh, he just beat me on the ground. I can't even hit people on the ground. How come he can hit me on the ground? All right. That's saying something since this game is basically one giant escort mission. Yeah, yeah. This game is one giant e escort mission. Escort missions aren't bad if the AI is good. And this is, this AI is definitely lacking. But this is also 360 era, so you can kind of give it a pass. So what can I do? What can I do? I need to close the gap quicker. That's my problem. I need to close the gap quicker. Not that I'm running around with um, high riding shorts and a tight t-shirt and a, uh, a Lego helmet. No, I need to close the gap quicker. There has to be something. There's a way. I know there's a way. There has to be a way. I just don't remember what the way is. I have lost the way. Alternatively, I can get a gun. So it's not like I, I'm completely out of options. Like I can't, I can't hit anything on the ground, but they, uh, but he can hit me.
Okay, I could throw something at it, but that's that, that's not the point. That's not the point. I have a little bit of time. I'm going to look around for a moment. I'm going to go into the, some of the stores to see if I could see something that'll spark a memory on how to move quickly. Oh, oh a chair. That's how I move quickly. You know, without a chair, I would definitely be not not be able to move at all. Gems, huh? What is this? It's a range, it's a scatter. Oh, this is the kid's clothing. This is where I got the, uh, the current outfit. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it kind of stuns him. Do you think that would potentially help with the, uh, the boss? Like, the zombies are still alive. That's how much damage it's not doing. Stuff there? Yeah, okay. <laughs> Look at all that damage the bear's doing. Alright. We already know what the hangar does. So I don't think it's here. Let's see, we got a lady about town. Handbag, we know what the handbag does. It doesn't really do much. It's just like the standard stuff, something standard. Cash register, handbag, basically like a little, well, what, what, you would, what you would expect when it comes to a handbag and attacking, so. Marriage makers. Looks like this is going to be more gems. And this, right? And right? Nope. Okay. Sport trance. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think this is it. I think this is it. Yep, there it is. My fast moving, moving, movings. I don't remember how to use a skateboard, but this is it. I don't know how to jump. <laughs> I can't jump. Okay, so I think there's a book on abilities for the skateboard. Where's the book? Where would the book be? <clears throat> I mean, of course I can just use the board, get around. But this is it. That's how I'm. That's how I can move around. Okay, let's uh, go after the professor. I now have a lot of time lost. Okay, let's see if this helps. Let's see if this helps, because I'm able to kind of veer around quicker and close the gap quicker. So here's hoping, right? But that's it. It's the skateboard. It's the skateboard. Yes. Oh, man. All right, here we go. Oh. 
<laughs> you know, I'm able to close the gap. All right, so we're able to do something. This is this is interesting. I'm able to fall down. That's interesting. So we have something. We have a game plan. It's not a good game plan, but it's a game plan. All right, that's the thing. I can I can skateboard upstairs. You know. Like everyone can. I don't have any more health, so... Gotta wait for him. We have a game plan. It's not a good game plan. It is not a good game plan. Not a good game plan. Not a good game plan. I don't have the inventory. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just think, let's think. What can I drop? I have... Give me a second, I gotta... I guess I have to go out through here before I can actually read these books. <clears throat> Reading is not allowed in the security room. To be fair, most of your plans aren't good. Hey, I'm, I don't play this game to be judged. Okay, that's a lie. So I'm going to drop that. That's uh, to improve my knee phase. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. I think this will work. So this will give me one more health. And that skateboard. The skateboard, though. Yes, 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 yes. So where was that skateboard? I think it was upstairs. Yes, it was over there, right? Ah, oh, you. Mm. Yes, yeah, sports trance in here, right? Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> Oh, what is it, Otis? Okay, we now have a skateboard. We now need to get a little bit of food to stock up. And we are good to go. Oh, I can go through them. I cannot. Oh, no. I lost the skateboard. I have to go back. The skateboard's broken. Okay. Okay. So the skateboard, I cannot hit anything with the skateboard. Otherwise, it's going to lose their ability. That's what I gather. Okay. So I cannot hit things with the skateboard. That's fine. That's fine. But the thing is, I'm also out of food. Well, when I say out of food, I mean that lightly. 
As in, uh, I'm out of extra food. I can't, I don't know where any are at, uh, where any is, where any's at. Bump. <laughs> but we made it, we made it. So. What can we do? What can we do? I am basically at the same situation as I was previously. I'm at this boss fight with only two or three things of food. Oh, you bastard. I might have to find another another weapon instead of the knife. Because he's just gonna smack me. Like that. And then he's gonna throw a grenade because I'm not fast enough. Because I'm not fast enough. All right. This guy's starting to get annoying. I'm just not fast enough to catch him. Just so slow. I mean, I was annoyed by his speed before, but now that I can't even catch up to someone with a big old 50 millimeter hand, like not even a hand cannon, just like a huge old rifle. Um, options. I guess I can get a gun and deal with that mess. Grab a couple of pistols. That way I don't have to worry about the skateboard. Oh, I got to make sure that uh, I got a fresh knife just in case. I was really kind of trying to avoid using a gun because of how dumb the aiming is, how dumb the controls are. But I might not have the opportunity to do that. So we're just gonna walk around a little bit, see if we can't find police officers with uh, pistols that we can acquire. And Otis is going to bother us here momentarily. Hmm. Let's see. All right. Um. Let's see if we can't find a gun, a couple of guns. But why is it that when I'm looking for pistols, I can't find them?
Yeah, he's just too slow. He's just too slow. Yeah, there might be some extra food in here. This is the there, so I'm just going to drop that. I don't need that. That's a pie. Pies only heal one. But orange juice, that heals a lot. Ah, oh, that dodge. Let's see if I can go to skill and turn it off. Status, skills. Jump kick, zombie ride, flying dodge. Nope, I can't turn it off. I want that thing turned off. I hate that so much. It's not the dodge because you probably have some iframes to work with, but it's the uh, it's this. I can't move. Oh, there we go. Well, there's some pistols. All right, so let's um, drink this. I'm gonna have to grab another knife because I'm using it all right here. Grab a handgun. Go back to the restaurant. Where was the restaurant? There. Get that one health back. See if I can't find someone carrying a knife now. Oh, what a pain. What a pain. All right. Now I've got to find a knife. You know what? I'm moving on. I want to see if the gun even does anything. I don't even have the theme of Jiggy Active. One second. All right, we got a pistol, we got a damaged knife, we have full health with extras, and we have a skateboard. Let's see how badly we do now. And I can't move while aiming the pistol. That's probably one of the biggest things about this. I can't move. The movement is left stick, but when I hold the right trigger to aim and I push the left stick, it actually rotates the gun. I don't think a pistol's gonna work. Maybe I'll use the pistol without aiming. You know, that wasn't too bad until that happened.
So we're not doing great, but we are unveiling quite a few things, such as me being bounced around. He hit himself with a grenade? This might be an opportunity. Here we go. Oh, no. Okay, we got him. We got him. Oh. Man, just, man. He's unconscious, but alive. Well, stop putting weight on it and bind it, you fool. What is this, a zombie game? Tend to your wound. Do I have to actually walk there, or is it going to be a quick cut? It's a quick cut that I could save. Wonderful. Oh my God. How is your poor aiming doing? Still doing wonderful. It's out as if it's taken effect. <laughs> This dome is so big, it's blocking the camera. Why did they give me an office temp for my partner? Stop the bleeding. But he's running a fever. He needs medicine. Fever. <laughs> medicine, huh? All right. It is so hard to take this game seriously when you're walking around with a Lego head. Oh, there's no food here either. Uh, uh, it doesn't matter what's going on at this point. We're doing this. Oh, I, I don't have a lot of time for the medicine run either. All right, let's see. I'm missing out on quite a bit of chat once. Uh, I forgot this game was during the Tony Hawk Pro Skate. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was um, 2006, I think. So it wasn't necessarily at the beginning of the Tony Hawk. Because I remember playing Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3 when it first came out on the PlayStation 2, I think. Good news. It just got word for my little cousin is going to be uh, is going to be having his last chemo this week. And then the scans I should hopefully be can. That is fantastic news. I'm really hoping... I I I'm, I'm hope everything turns out well. I hope this is the last thing because your cousin needs to just not. He's that, that's just terrible, heartbreaking, really. Uh, he's got the cure for the fever and those booty shorts. <laughs> From Solomon Sirius to booty short jokes. Okay, so we got to do this. We gotta we gotta go get the medicine. We cannot stock up. We cannot save anybody. We gotta do the medicine run. I'm wondering if this short time has anything to do with um, how long it took for me to get to this point. Bollocks. And I have six shots of the gun, which is kind of useless, but you know, it actually helped during the fight. However, I don't have, there, now I don't have to worry about that. I don't have speedy Gonzalez movements, so I have to get the skateboard again. Now I vaguely remember the skateboard being more durable 
and being able to do maneuvers. So I think there there are books for those too. So I'm gonna have to keep an eye on skateboarding books. Uh. I'm gonna have to walk, go through the park. Oh, stop sucking. Never mind. It wants me to go through here. So I might. Okay, where's it? Where does it want me to go? Does want me to go to the north or over here? So that means I could actually go to the bathroom and do the shortcut. Or not. Where does it want me to go? Arrow. Be more arrowy. Okay, so I can't use the bathroom shortcut. How am I supposed to get this run? Okay. <clears throat> this is days away and I have to return this stuff too. Oh, uh, you're not going to go through there, huh? Okay. Food and stuff, huh? I guess I'm going into food and stuff. The pharmacy. Oh, great. I have to do a boss fight with this, too? If I have to do a boss fight with this amount of time, I might have to just go to the game, level up, then return, because I don't have the time. I don't have the speed. I don't have the health. I don't have the power. But I definitely have the outfit. You know, this place is pretty full and stocked for a zombie apocalypse. Now we know why it's so full and <laughs> came to vandalize my store. Huh? Not on my watch! Someone's been hurt. I need medicine. Hurt! That's just what this bitch said when she came to vandalize my store. Store! I don't take kindly to vandalism. I won't allow it. 
to me. And listen good, partner. I don't allow vandalism in my store! All right. I wonder if he allows vandalism. So... So... Do I have to fight him? Or can I just grab the medicine? No, it looks like I have to fight him. Oh, well, I'm at least on top of here, but I don't think I have any food. Oh, I don't have any life either. Okay, so now i got a situation. i got to fight a boss at the same time as doing the medicine run. Is that even going to be possible? This boss doesn't seem too difficult, so we'll see how things turn out. But the medicine run with that low amount of time, I just don't know. I just don't know. It's difficult to say, uh, we'll find out. I'm running low on time on a lot of things. So I really need to speed things up. Yeah. So we know where we need to go. That's the good news. And we're not going to waste all that time looking for well, much of anything. I do need to start the medicine run so I have an arrow where exactly I need to go. I just don't have the room to maneuver so I can't even use the skateboard. There we go. All right, now we can go to the north end. So we're going to hopefully have more time to deal with the crazed store manager. Okay, we're making good time. I was actually worried a little bit. Uh-oh. I hit a couple fools. So I'm probably going to be running low on uh, health on the skateboard. Yeah. Turn around? Uh-oh. Did I go too far? Oh, well, goodness. This is a couple of things for me to eat here. And there is a queen right here. All right, where to, where to? Right here, okay. 
So I actually came into the other side the other time, so I went the wrong direction. Well, we have more time than we did last time. So we'll see how things turn out. We'll see how things turn out. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this again. See if I can get down before he shoots. There we go. See if I can get up before he shoots. Dang it. All right, we're going to stock up on a little bit of food here. We have a moment. If he's going to be a D-bag. He's going to shoot me, I bet. Nope. See if I can finish him off. There we go. There we go. There we go. My store. My store. Who will run my store when I'm gone? Walmart. Yes. Customers. <laughs> Have a nice day. <laughs> Clean up. Register six. That's that's what's wrong. Okay, that's what's going on. He says while in the store. Can you stand? That's quick. Look, I, uh, I saw you at the entrance yesterday. You needed medicine too. Maybe we should work together. I don't need any help. You people don't know a thing. You're the one who caused this nightmare. You ruined Santa Cabeza and started all this. Uh, I have a Lego face. I didn't do anything. I'm wearing booty shorts. There's no way. My love trail <laughs> means I didn't do anything. All right. We are still on the clock, and we don't have a lot of time. We made pretty decent time getting to this point. Ah, oh, this stupid dodge. We made good time getting to this point. So if the mission fails, this is a lost cause. That means that I'm going to have to start the game from the beginning because there's no way I'm going to be able to, oh, just wonderful. <clears throat> I'm going to be able to complete this mission because now I have to physically run back. I don't have a skateboard.
I do have a queen, but no skateboard. I just don't think, I just don't think I'm gonna have the time. And if I do fail and it's it's over, yeah, I'm just probably going to walk around, learn the mall a little bit more, save some peats. Play with some weapons and then start the game again. That's kind of my general plan. But I'm not going to be able to get lovers. Just don't have the time. Yeah, I'm just I'm just not going to have the time for that. Unless I can get there really quickly. Uh, it's going to be tight though. Where's the Hummer? I think it's on the other side. Probably trapped on a tree. So that's kind of what's going on. I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it. I don't know, I've been surprised. I thought I was gonna fail, but I haven't thus far. I haven't yet. Swap out for a fresh knife. I did not pay for that lady. That is not consent. I did not start all of this. I took pictures and witnessed the stupidity. That's all I did. Getting close, I'm at the warehouse. So, oh, there it goes. No, no, I'm, I'm still good. That was just a lover's. That was a lover's. So far... So good. I'm surprised, honestly. Like, photo challenge, what's that? I don't even remember what that was. But hey, I got back here. Maybe it's because I got the medicine that the timer didn't run out. Okay. <clears throat> so we're still good to go. I'm actually surprised. I seriously thought that was it. I was saying, like I was saying, like I was saying, holy criminy. So what? It has become apparent that I do not have the time. So I guess I'm just going to... I have to start from the beginning.
is I'm not going to have the time. I have to start from the beginning. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to save. And I want to see if I can start from the beginning. Kind of like a little new game plus. Uh, there's nothing I can do about it at the moment. It's just... What, what am I supposed to do? Yeah. What do you want me to do? I have, I have two options at this point. I can continue playing wandering around the mall as a level up for the rest of the day. <clears throat> and next time, start from the beginning as a new game plus. Or I could just start the new game plus now. What do you want me to do, chat? What do you want me to do? Start the new game now. Do you think you know the mall enough to start now? I mean, kind of. It's it's difficult to say. Uh, I'm still learning things. Heck, I just uh, for two and a half episodes, I didn't know about the skateboard. At least I forgot about it. There's other things I probably forgot about. But yeah, let's just start from the beginning. See if we can't figure out how to do that real quick. I guess I have to die. All right, let's uh, let's just go ahead and see what happens if we KO. You know. <clears throat> See if we cast our new game from here. Uh, quit without saving, stay, save status and quit. Well, there's no going back now. There's no going back now. Start game. Yes. I'm feeling pretty good about this. We have a little bit more understanding what's going on at the game. We're not level one. Uh oh, we don't have the Lego. We don't have our outfit. We are outfitless. That's going to be one of our first priorities, right? Step one get outfit. Okay, I can skip that. I'm like, um, do I really have to do this? No, we got the outfit. All is whole again. All is whole. Step one accomplished. All right, so this is before we discover what's going on, so we have to go out this way. And I'm curious, can we save anybody from the beginning? I don't think so, but we'll try. We will actually put in the effort of saving somebody in the beginning. Not you.
All right, let's see if I can get anyone to follow us. Just anybody. See, they're not even moving. So I don't think they're meant to be saved. So yeah, I'm just going to move on then. If they don't want to be saved, I'm just going to let them do their thing. I'm just going to let them do their thing. Let's see, what's next? What do I need to do? I need to save so I don't have to do that again. And eat an apple, one of those, next. Got some coffee creamer I want to sleep with. You know, if I don't have my coffee creamer when I go to sleep, I just don't sleep very well. <laughs> All right, then. We're going to go out barehanded. Oh, we got to get the, uh, the phone and the map from Otis. There we go. Now we know about the skateboard. That's going to be one of those first things we're going to be doing. Actually, no, we got to uh, hey, save hey, these two, huh? Yeah. Get this for the elevator here soon enough. Let's get some quick experience because pictures give us lots of pp <laughs> give us big pp goat and once we get enough pp we level Okay, are they following? Are they following? Are they following uh, Lego guy? Come on. And there we go. So we're going to ignore the elevator. We know about the, the roundabout route, right? The routeabout. <laughs> and I have a soccer ball just in case I do run into a, a gathering that I need to disperse. <clears throat> we're going to have to listen to Otis from the, uh, like on everything again, huh? I wonder if we go to the restrooms, we can access the secret passage immediately. Do you think that we can do that? So let's go to the restroom, jump up on the counter, and see if we can't access that. Don't cut me off, it's rude. Come on, Otis. Then hurry up. Is there like a, an option on how fast Otis will talk? Okay, first things first, we're going to pick up the photographer book. Then we're going to go after the skateboard, which was over here.
Got to give that girl five. I'm going to grab some food to the left, get those two hit points back. Just scarf down some Lego pie. Okay, we got the skateboard. Next is back up Brad, but let's go to the bathroom first. All right, let's see if it works. Nope, okay. So it looks like we're gonna to have to unlock the, uh, the bathroom by getting Greg. That's what it looks like. So first things first, I guess we'll need to go get Brad. It's right about there. Oh, this is so much more familiar, so much better. Yes, yes, yes. Being able to move like just quicker to get to where we need to go because Frank is a slow hoe. All right, we got to clear out that area, so it's time to mow the grass. There we go. Perfect. No, it really wasn't. Now we're going to have to face off against this guy. We have the um, skateboard, but I don't think it's going to really help us. I want to grab some health real quick. I did not do the I did not do the best over there. So I really don't know how to uh, blend stuff. I don't know any combinations. So. Actually, let's check it out right here. Recommended bedroom, you're feeling right down. Health tonic. That doesn't really help. That was an unhelpful tonic. Chomp on some corn. Yeah, when I did this the last time, I had a baseball bat that I was able to engage melee in, but not this time. Ah, that stupid dodge. I don't know why I charged because I don't have a melee weapon. 
Oh, what do you want, Otis? Boss fight, hurry it up, hurry it up. I'd say Brad can handle it, but he can't even handle himself. <laughs> Mowing people, what's this game? All right. I'm now out of ammo, so I have to do this by hand. Here we go. Fly and jump kick. Oh, the kick gets it. The jump kick gets it. Okay. I didn't expect the jump kick to actually make it. Brad is just wasting time. You ready to go, Brad? Oh, I'm waiting on you, you bastard. At least he's not wearing his glasses indoors, right? All right, first thing we need to I'm looking for books, it's like a bookstore, so Plot Twist will be happy. I'm looking for bookstores, me, out of all the people. Bug store, bug store, bug store, bug store. All right. Actually, there's the bookstore right there, and it's closed off. So now I need to go back to the beginning. So let's uh, take a moment, see what's down here. Skateboarding upstairs is definitely a thing. I've seen it happen. I've seen it done. Hmm. 
let's just move on. Let's just move on. Currently, I feel like I'm wasting time. Uh, the the bookstore is locked. Books are a rare commodity at this day and age, apparently. <laughs> Oof, ow. Frank, you're in the food court now. One plus one. Yeah, the uh, Humvee is not around because uh, it hasn't spawned yet. I don't know exactly what triggers it, but I know as soon as I get the Humvee spawn, I have an escort mission to attend to. Just currently making our way back to the security place. I'm thinking about doing is I'm going to the sports place and getting a new skateboard, but I think I'll be okay for now. Also, what I need to do, oh, what I should do actually, is go talk to that, that photographer up on the second floor. Now that we know that uh, this is where the battery gets charged, we could talk to the photographer, get that out of the way, get a small little hit of experience. And you get a new skateboard while we're at it. All right. I'm just waiting for you to get to the point. Get out of your hair because it's all up. Yeah, this guy is annoying. This guy is super annoying. I'm looking at my watch of how annoying he is. Are we done? Can we move on? Thank you. Moving on. We can now move on. This guy is so annoying. Just going to drop that skateboard, pick up a new one, make our way to the security place again. There we go. Grab the battery charger. Oh, that's right, it's right here, actually. And we are now back in the warehouse.
That's actually the wrong one. Oh, I don't have the uh, the book to make the knife actually long lasting, so I got to use this very sparingly. Uh, what? What are you doing? Why? Why'd you drink that? What? This is stupid. I can't tell you how dumb that was. Whatever. Just whatever. Just drop that stupid gun. All right, we are now back in here. Good news is we can get some health at the same time. So I'm going to grab some chomp chomps over here. I have until low 600 the next day. You have to just drink coffee creamer straight out of the uh, the can because, or the bottle, because that's what real Lego heads do. And just like that, we are getting pretty close to where we left off. Granted, we are not where we left off because we still have a time. This is still a time-based game, but we can get stuff done. We can still get stuff done. So one of the things I want to do is see if I can get that, uh, I guess get that taken care of. Okay. So we have that where was that again where was that oh fresco that means we're going to have to go across the uh park so that also means i can just ride along for a bit So I believe there's a bookstore over there that I can start to pilfer. I remember getting the, no, no, that was the Japanese guy. Maybe not. Well, I have plenty of time. I can look around. I can look around. First, I got to clear out the doorway. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't know what he was doing. Why did he pick it up? I don't know. Let's check out what kind of health stuff we have. We have, yeah, I think we're good on that. Let's pick up one bottle of wine just in case. All right, we got this over here, which is always so fun to do.
And then this guy's gonna want to target us, so we'll just... Are you done? Are you done? Come on, dude, hurry up. Finish your train of thought so we can move on. Gotcha. Roger. Thanks. Okay, now we have Bert and Ernie, both uh, armed and equipped. We're going to see if they can't effectively follow me as we make our way back to the security room. And they're still in there. What are you doing? Where's the other guy? The other guy is still over here. Why is he over here? Um, okay. Come on, dude. There we go. He's finally moving. He's finally moving. He is finally moving. Look at these two fools. Just hurry up. It's not that difficult. Are any of you bums hurt? Yeah, a little bit. Here. No more drink in front of him. Hey, I know you're hurt. Let me just drink my booze. You got it. And then I want to have to pick up that knife, give the uh -huh. knife back to him. Gotcha. That way, he has something to defend himself when we inevitably get ambushed. Yeah, when we get back to... Hello? Really, you two? Really? Follow. What are we doing here? Come on. Ah. Morons. They're sharing a brain cell. Leave them alone. Over there. Are you sure it's one brain cell? Are you sure it's not zero? Follow me. Over there. Because it's my time they're wasting at this point. All right. So far, so good. This is what I have to do to get them to follow. This is what I'm going to do. Come on, fool. Come on. Follow me. I mean, I would understand that they had difficulty following if I was on the skateboard, but I'm not. I am just slow. I'm actually going to do this. Because I need to take care of... Um, the zombies in the door. King Salmon. Um, I got a King Salmon as a weapon. <laughs> I am not complaining. <laughs> Let's see what happens. 
Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. So the King Salmon only has two hits. Got it. All right, they should be following. Fisher Slapper. Just waiting for these fools to go. I can use this. Almost done. Almost there. There we go. Slowly but surely making these fools go where they need to go and dodging them to a group of zombies because that's what Frank does. Let's see if I can't make him go to the camera, sto uh, camera store. I don't know what you're doing. I heard you say, what are we doing? I don't know what you're doing. Come on. I'll just take a picture of you two losers. Come on. Like I said, escort missions aren't bad if the AI is good. This is an example of not good AI. I'm not going to say anything. What needs to be said of, out of that poor performance? Over there. Look at that run. Yeah, run before I beat you up some more. Moronic. It's just moronic. Now, are they both going to follow or are they going to stay behind? Okay, it looks like they're following. That's, that's a rarity. I thought they were going to stay behind again because reasons. Come on. Oh no, there's not even zomboys here. That's fine. That's fine. It's not like I can't get another one. He runs like something's in his... Well, yes, yes, he does. Man, saving these two was an ordeal. Such an ordeal. All right. Let's just save that effing thing. Not have to worry about doing that again. And call it a day. The AI, the AI is just so, it's balls. It's so balls. Uh, but you know what? 360, okay, I gotta remember it's just 360 stuff. They didn't have a lot of AI back then. They don't have a lot of AI now. So, but uh, yeah, one ordeal. That just about does it for this episode. If you enjoyed the content, like, subscribe, notification, follow, or be a clown with two chainsaws juggling, and whatever you do, Facebook, 
or Twitter or anything like that wants you to do nowadays, then check out my website, jpedgar.com, where I got my books, my blog, and my merch, and my stream schedule. And just reminded that my stream and my archives, separate channels, check the description, and that should just about do it. Again, thank you very much for keeping me company, making fun of me, and just following me on this stupid ride. <laughs> I really do appreciate it, though. Thank you very much. And now, as always, more ridiculous to come.